year 2023 marks the 50th anniversary of the National Youth Service Corps NYSC. As part of this celebration, I'll be sharing with you in this video some interesting historical facts about the scheme. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video with your friends. After the Nigerian Civil War of 1967, the military government under the leadership of General Yakubu Guwon established the National Youth Service Corps on 22nd of May 1973. The program was established with a view to encourage and develop common ties among Nigerian youths and promote national unity. I truly accepted that if Nigeria is to make rapid progress on all fronts internally and if she is to make her mark on the continent of Africa and indeed in the Committee of Nations, then her youth must be fully mobilized and be prepared to offer willingly and without asking for rewards in return their best in the service of their nation at all times. The establishment of the National Youth Service Corps is the first step towards the realization of this uh, lofty goal. In conclusion, I wish to assure you, Mr. Chairman and members of the Directorate of the National Youth Service Corps, of the full support and cooperation of all the governments in the Federation in your undertakings. The anthem Youth Obey the Clarion Call is said to have been composed by the late Wale Adetiron, who served at Polytechnic Ibadan in the year 1984. However, in November 2022, Professor Frederick Mosu wrote Point newspaper saying that he composed the anthem. According to him, a former colleague of his, Deji, wrote the wordings while he composed the song himself. Colonel Amadou Ali served as the first Director General of the National Youth Service Corps from 1973 to 1975. Between 1973 and 2023, NYSC has been under the leadership of about 21 Director Generals. The current NYSC DG is Brigadier General Yushao Dogara Ahmed. He was sworn in in January 2023. I hope you enjoyed these historical facts. Long live the National Youth Service Corps. Long live Nigeria. <laughs>